Hi, welcome back to Inside Guelph. It's time for your Guelph City update. And joining us now is Mayor Farbridge. Thanks for being here. My welcome pleasure back to the always. program. Feels really bright in here. I today. know. It's, so, it's always sunny in here. Yes. Our, our flowers just thrive under these lights. <laughs> um, oh, yeah. So you're here to talk about it. It's a local business engagement survey. Yes. So obviously my first question is, what what is that? Yeah. So this is a nice opportunity for me to let your business viewers know about the engagement survey and encourage them to participate in it. Um, there's a lot of services in the community um, that are provided by funded by different levels of government, different organizations, agencies, even the university, the Chamber of Commerce. Um, and so we're wanting to see how well th known those services are. So mm -hmm. do our local businesses know that there are these opportunities for them? Um, and so that will help us in t and, and um, knowing whether uh, there's a gap there in knowledge. Right. But then also, are these the kinds of services that um, the business community is looking for and, and needing? Um, mm -hmm. So the relevance of it. So again, useful for all of the organizations and agencies. Um, right. It's a joint partnership between the university, the city, and the chamber. So it's a, a great partnership even in delivering the right. survey and there's some students doing that the students are actually yes. creating the survey yeah. perfect and why we're doing it mm -hmm. um, to get this information and and so that we can um, make sure that we're putting resources in the right place that's a good thing but I think even lifting it up a little bit higher why do this in the first place mm -hmm. is we talk a lot about how do we recruit new businesses to our community um, to bring new jobs into the into the community but we can't forget the businesses that are here who are currently providing jobs and are and have opportunities to grow sure. um, um, we want to make sure that they stay here. We want to make sure that there aren't any um, issues or barriers that um, lead them to look elsewhere, perhaps when they're looking to expand. Um, so it's to ensure that we can make sure that we retain the great um, businesses that we have locally and, and uh, so that they can continue to grow and thrive and Brilliant. grow jobs through that sector. Brilliant. Through the it's existing like a check-in. It's a great yeah. check-in. Where do people, it's going till the end of the month, so yeah. where do businesses uh, get a hold of this survey? Um, as usual, online. online. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Most easy way to do it. I know there's okay. going to be communications out as well, so if they are getting approached by it, then they know a little okay. bit about what it is and, and hopefully we'll be able to spend some time and participate in it. And spending time it's only 30 minutes yeah. about to take the survey yeah. okay yeah. great so then tomorrow it's random acts of kindness day yeah. and you have some thoughts on that yeah and then you know it's it's to do it in the moment right you're right. standing in the lineup and someone's ordered a coffee in front of you and you say oh I'll get that as well as my own that kind of yeah. thing to make someone stay but one of the things that I've been trying to promote uh, over the last uh, several months and so I'm going to use this opportunity and try to fit in into random acts of kindness and um, that's um, going online to register as an organ donor. Mm. Um, I am, I'm often on your show and I talk about all the great things about Guelph, lowest unemployment rate and, and lowest crime severity yeah. index, all those things. Well, on organ donation, we are we don't do well relative oh. to the province. We are way down on the list. We're like 80th or 81st in terms of municipalities. Oh, I'm shocked. I know. So um, so I, every time I get a chance, when I can fit it in, um, I promote people going online um, to be a donor. Uh, be a donor .ca. Be a donor .ca. And okay. uh, it takes two minutes. Literally yeah. takes two minutes. It's so easy to do. All you need is your health card number, mm -hmm. um, and you can go on and you can make potentially. Well, I mean, w we hope that everyone lives. Of course, but, of course. But in the in the worst case scenario, um, you your organs can help eight people and perhaps sa save eight people's lives. So that is definitely passing yeah. it forward. And yeah. that's a quick, easy, yeah. um, random act of kindness. Yeah. Yeah. So this is be a donor, just as it sounds. Be a a d o n o r dot c a. Yeah, and you can pick up the cards for random acts of kindness all over town, yeah. and hopefully you have a pocket yeah. full. You're going to be passing it all around yeah. town. Yeah, and so I think you you know if you do yes. that, you can pass it pass a card forward. Perfect, both do it both. Thank you so much for okay. being here, and happy random acts of kindness day. Does that count as my rent? No, probably not. <laughs> I need to do more than that. All right, taking a short break. When we get back, Innovation Guelph here talking about their Pitch It event. We'll see you back here in a moment.